Ever wondered why your laptop has both a CPU and a GPU? Aren't they both processors? Yes, but they work very differently. What's the real difference of CPU versus GPU? The CPU, or central processing unit, is your computer's main brain. It handles general tasks, like opening programs, loading web pages, typing in Word, or calculating spreadsheets, fast and smart, but it mostly does one or a few tasks at a time, using serial processing. Think of it like a skilled executive, handling important decisions, one after the other, very efficiently. Modern CPUs have a few powerful cores, so they can multitask to an extent, but they're still optimized for step-by-step -step tasks. Now the GPU, or graphics processing unit, is a bit different, designed to handle hundreds or thousands of tasks simultaneously, especially visual tasks like rendering graphics, processing video, and even running AI models. Imagine a big team of assistants, each handling small jobs all at once, it's the GPU's strength, parallel processing. Think of CPU as like a head chef, working carefully on one dish at a time. The GPU is like a kitchen crew, each one chopping, boiling, grilling, all together. You need the chef for decisions. But you need the crew when there's a lot of work to do fast. When do you need each? Working in Word or browsing the web? Your CPU is doing most of the job. Gaming, editing videos, or 3D design. That's when your GPU shines. AI and crypto mining? They rely heavily on the GPU's parallel power. All laptops have a CPU, and most have a GPU either built in, integrated, or separate, dedicated. All modern smartphones have both a CPU and GPU inside their system on chip, SOC. So remember, CPU equals thinker, decision maker, doing serial processing, GPU equals worker, multitasker, doing parallel processing. They're a team. CPU plus GPU equals a smooth, powerful device.